watched that uh, Michigan State game in '93 with your dad. He got the first time you watched it. He got kind of emotional. Can you tell tell me a little more about that? What what got to him, and how did he express it to you guys? How much it meant to him? Yeah, no, just because like we watched it together for the first time. My brother's named after Chris Street, um, and that just it kind of hits home for him. Uh, just being there, having Chris there, watching it with us. Um, I mean, that game was huge. Uh, just the impact of the whole Iowa basketball organization as a whole. And uh, the first time watching it, obviously it's emotional uh, for him just because Chris was one of his best friends. Uh, he took him under his wing uh, when my dad first got to Iowa. So that was just a big moment for him. Do you remember how old you were when you first watched it? I was, a, I was in elementary school, so I was really, really young. Uh, but we watched on a, his, one of his VHS tapes. Old school. Yeah, very old. Thanks. Yep. On camera, go ahead. Yeah, Keegan, now that it's been about five weeks since that first Rutgers game, I guess, what, what did that do for you as a player, the, the ability you had to perform in the clutch moments? And what can you draw on from that game to help your career going forward? Yeah, no, that game was really just a, it felt like an old school Big Ten game. There's a lot of lead changes back and forth. Um, it was probably one of the first games where I got to experience that, uh, just the adversity that you have uh, in the Big Ten playing on the road against a, uh, I think they're ranked 14th, top 15 team. Uh, and getting that win, uh, I just felt like it really boosted my confidence uh, going into the, the rest of the games this year. And uh, I feel like uh, that game really helped our team believe that uh, we can win a lot of games. We just got to get back on that track. What are you proudest of in terms of what you did in that game? Yeah, I was just a, uh, proud of like how I did the little things. Uh, I got a rebound with about 16 seconds left. I made the two free throws after that, but I also had three blocks and three steals. So I just felt like my activity level was really high that game, um, and that helped us overall. Other questions for Keegan? Yeah, I'll keep going. So how can your team draw on that game now? You've had, you've had some rough moments down the stretch. So how, right. how can you, uh, I guess, look back at, at that game? What can that do for you, you as a team? Yeah, no, just looking at, back at that game, uh, we beat them on the road, so they're going to come in here hungry. Uh, we just got to fight adversity when there's adversity. Um, we believe, we know that we can win this game. Um, but there's two ways that we can look at this. We can either, we've lost four of the last five, we can either put our heads down mope about it, be sad for ourselves, uh, have everyone feel sad for ourselves, or we can go out uh, go out with a uh, mindset that we're the team that we, st want, that we uh, felt like we could be at the beginning of the year and that we've shown. And that's something that we all believe in right now. Um, we're just ready to get back to work, uh, get back into the win column this week.